Hi dears, welcome to mathematics class. Our topic is exponents, practice questions, part one. In previous lessons we discussed about the exponents. Now uh, I want to solve some uh, questions or some problems for you for more practice on exponents. Number one, simplify. Eight to the power of minus two times nine to the power of three over four all to the power of minus or negative 2 over 3. Now we see that this one and this one both at the same time are at the, to the power of negative 2 over 3. We can write both of them separately it is equal to 8 to the power of negative 2 all to the power of negative or minus 2 over 3 times 9 to the power of 3 over 4 all to the power of negative 2 over 3. Now we know that each the power and the, uh, the power, one number to the power and the another power, we multiply these powers. It means that it is equal to 8 to the power of negative times negative is positive. 2 times 2 is 4 over 3. Times 9 to the power of negative positive times negative is negative. 3 cancel with 3. 1 to 2, 2 to 4. Negative 1 over 2. So this is equal to, we can write this one, like uh, the denominator, the denominator under the uh, is the meaning of the root and the numerator is power. 8 under the third root to the power of 4 times if some number is the power of some number is negative we make uh, we write the reciprocal of that one to become the positive it means that 1 over 9 to the power of 1 over 2 1 over 2 means the square root oh, sorry 1 over 9 one over right means the square, square root or the root of second root of the nine. So now this is equal to third root of the eight is two. 
It means that 2 times 2 times 2 means is equal to 8. 2 to the power of 4 times 1 over the square root of 9 is 3. And this is equal to 2 to the power, to the power of 4 means 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, 4 times. 2 times 2, 4, 4 times 2, 8, 8 times 2, 16. times 1 over 3 1 over 3 or this is equal to the numerator of 16 is 1 New, uh, numerator multiply with the numerator 16 times 1 is 16 and the numerator is 3 16 over 3 we can write this as a a mixture of the whole number and the, uh, this is the, this is not a, a pure fraction. This is a mixture of whole number and the fraction. We can write this one: 16 times 3 is equal to 5, and remaining 1, 5 whole number, 5 whole, 1 over 3. Again, if we do like that, 5 times 3 is 15, 15 plus 1 is equal to 16 over 3. So the last simplified answer for this question is 5, 1 over 3 or 16 over 3. I repeat for you. Simplified exponents practice questions. Simplify number 1. 8 to the power of negative 2 times 9 to the power of 3 over 4 all to the power of negative 2 over 3 is equal to 8 to the power of negative 2 to the power of negative 2 over 3 and times 9 to the power of 3 over 4 all to the power of negative 2 over 3. Now we multiply these exponents 8 to the power of negative times negative is positive 2 times 2 is 4 over 3 times 9 to the power of positive times negative is negative 3 cancels with 3 because this is a denominator this is a denominator 1 3, 2 2 2 2 4 1 over 2 and this is equal to 8 under uh, to the power, uh, power of the uh, denominator means uh, the root that's under the third root all to the power of 4 and the reciprocal because we want to uh, change this negative to positive so we write 1 over positive that number 1 over 9 to the power of positive 1 over 2 that is equal to the uh, square root of 9 and that is equal to the third root of the uh, 8 is 2 all to the power of 4 and 1 over the square root of 3 is 9 is 3 and this 2 to the power of 4 means 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, 4 times, 16 to, uh, times 1 over 3. And this is 1 times 16, 16 over 3, and is equal to 5, 1 over 3. Question number two. Simplify. Simplify. A to the power of negative 4 times B to the power of 2 under the 
third root or the cubic, cubic root times a to the power of 3 times b under the square root or root of 2 times a b b to the power of negative 3 under the sixth root. This is equal to a to the power of negative 4 times b to the power of 1 over 2 sorry, b to the power of 2 all to the power of the third root means 1 over 3 the second one is equal to a to the power of 3 b all to the power of second root means 1 over 2 and the other one a b to the power of negative 3 all to the power of 1 over 6. is equal to now we multiply each of the uh, each of these powers with this one a to the power of positive term negative is negative 4 over 3 times b to the power of 2 over 3 times a to the power of 3 over 2 b to the power of 1 times 1 over 2 1 over 2 and times a to the power of this is 6 1 over 6 times b to the power of positive times negative is negative 3 1 3 3 uh, 16 uh, 2 3 6 1 over 2 we cancel 3 with 3 we reduce that one to 1 over 2 negative 1 over 2. So now all of this in this uh, position of the multiplication in the multiplication we can add the uh, powers it means that a to the power of negative 4 over 3 plus 3 over 4 3 over 2 plus 1 over 6 times b to the power of 2 over 3 
प्लस वन ओवर टू माइनस वन ओवर टू एंड दिस इज इक्वल टू वी से कॉमन डेमोनेटर फॉर बोथ ऑफ दिस For this one, common denominator is six because six is divisible by all of them. That is equal to a to the power of the six is the common denominator. Six divided by three is two. Two times negative four is negative eight. Six divided by two is three. Three times three is nine. And six divided by six is one. One times one is equal to one. Times b to the power of for this one also common common denominator is six six divided by three is two two times two is four six divided by two is three three times one is three and six divided by two is three e three times negative one is negative three. And this is equal to a to the power of negative uh, eight and positive uh, negative eight and positive nine. Nine is positive one. Positive one and positive one is positive two over six. That is a one over three. Two over six means one over three. And times b to the power of negative three cancelled with the negative uh, positive three four with uh, there is remaining four over six four is where six means two over three two over three. And we can write this one as. Because both of them under the the denominator for both of them is uh, three, we can write a to the power of one. We can write a. If you write a or a to the power of one, it means same meaning. Two times b to the power of two, all under the third root. All under the is equal to a. b to the power of two under the third root. I repeat for you. Simplify a to the power of negative two four b to the power of two under the third root times a to the power of three b to the power of one or b under the uh, square root a to the power of one and b to the power of uh, negative three under the sixth root. We can write this one in the seed of root and the uh, to the Form of power a to the power of negative four b to the power of two all to the power of one over three times a to the power of three b to the power of one all to the under the uh, uh, square root means uh, one over two a to, a b to the power of negative three all under the 
uh, six root means one over six, and it's equal to a to the power of negative times positive is negative, four over three, b to the power of two over three, a to the power of three over two, b to the power of one over two, a to the power of one over six, b to the power of three over six, and three over six is negative three over six is one over two. Now we write a uh, in the uh, because these numbers are in the multiplication situation, or we can add the powers a to the power of negative four over three plus three over two plus one over six, and b to the power of 2 over 3 plus 1 over 2 minus 1 over 2. Now we add these ones, call the common denominator, a 6, and for this one also 6, 6 times divided by 3 is 2, 2 times negative 4 is 8, 6 divided by 2 is 3, 3 times 3 is 9, 6 divided by 6 is 1, 1 times 1 is 1, here 6 divided by 3 is 2, 2 times 2 is 4, 6 divided by 2 is 3, 3 times 1 is 3, 6 divided by 2 is 3, 3 times 1 is negative 3. And a to the power of negative 8 and positive 9 is positive 1, positive 1 and positive 1 is positive 2 over 3, 2 over 6, 2 over 6 is 1 over 3. One, and here, negative, uh, positive 3 cancel with negative 3, and here remaining 4 over 6, 4 over 6 is 2 over 3. 1 over a to the power of 1 over 3 times, times b to the power of 2 over 3. Now we can write a to the power of 1 or a, b to the power of 2 under the third root or the under cubic root. Thank you for watching our video. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and share the video with your family and friends and please press the notification bell to get notified for more videos. Have a great and wonderful day and nice. Bye bye.